Hello everyone, welcome to another video on Google Bard API. Now in this video, I will show you how you can use Google Bard API for absolutely free. Now, as you can see, I found this on this uh, particular forum or in this particular blog site. As you can see, in order to enable Google Bard API, you will need to navigate to the API library in your Google Cloud Platform project. From there, all you have to do is search for the Google Bard API in the library and enable API for your project. Now, basically, this is how Google Cloud looks like right here. And if we go and click on it, uh, we can see that here we have a first project. So we can actually go here and create a project, right? You can go to the new project. You can create a project. This will be, let's say, Google Bard AI. Oops, Bard AI. And then we can just hit create. And uh, as you can see, um, once you have a project right here created, what you can do is you can go to the left side right here. We have a products and solutions. We have all products, but we also have API and services. Here we have library. So in library, as you can see here, you will be able to find Google Bard API. Now for me, it does not say it's available just as of right now. But if I type in AI and if I hit enter, I can get a, a lot of different AIs, APIs. So, uh, you know, artificial intelligence APIs, uh, APG API right here, as you can see. Um, but usually if you have already like, um, you know, if you already joined the waitlist for the Google Bard API, you will be able to go here and just type in Google Bard or Bard A API, right? But for me, it does not say anything right here about a BARD API. However, uh, I think this is still, you know, uh, not available for most people, but this is how you can use Google BARD API for free and how you can access it for free uh, once it's going to be available for everyone, right? You just go API services, you go to library, and then here you will be able to find the Google BARD API once uh, it's available. You can additionally add other APIs as well right here. But for now, uh, as far as I know, you, I can personally uh, go and you know, uh, search for the Google Bard API, nor can I obtain a Google Bard API key for now. But this will be the best way how you can obtain Google Bard API key. So hopefully you guys find this video useful and we'll see you in the next video.